I had often wondered what it would be like if this place closed forever. It would be still, quiet, peaceful, but it would be hollow, like a body without a soul. People didn't just come here to play a sport. They came to fight, to fight their stress, their anxieties, their depression, their loneliness, to make friends and unforgettable memories. They came because of people. Our community will miss the beautiful transformation of the woods this year. And our community will miss each other. People traveled from all over the country and claimed this was the best field they ever played at, but they were wrong and didn't know it. They were talking about the people they were playing with. And I wanted to show you how beautiful it was now. And although I respect its beauty, it feels like what's the point if there's no one to share it with? This place is home to so many. This place holds countless memories. I wish dearly that this crisis was one that could rather allow people to have this escape. Where people join together with one like-mindedness to suspend reality, to be a kid again, to use their imagination, to challenge themselves, to let go and to come together. I feel the countless memories suspended on every trail, every angle, every tree, every structure, and every vehicle. I mean, this is so much more than a business, but the situation happening is about lives before livelihood. And I don't know how long we will be closed. I cannot give an answer. And people will need this escape more than ever after. And so I promise you that we will be here when the storm passes. And we will be together again. I thank every single person who built this place up from nothing and I thank every company out there who helped us serve our community. I'm so thankful for what we have had and what I believe we will have in the future. Whatever happens to the businesses, we will have this place and we can restart. Hey, thank you guys for watching. I know that might seem a little melodramatic and stuff. I wasn't gonna put this on Swamp Sniper, don't worry. My stories and videos and entertaining stuff's coming. I just need to express myself. I just walked the land and uh, it was thinking about the thousands of people that come out here uh, and kind of escape and enjoy themselves. To be clear, businesses don't matter uh, compared to people's lives at stake. And I salute all the medical workers out there who are risking their own lives and I know a lot of you watching this right now uh, may very well lose loved ones and people that you care about. Um, this was just me expressing to my community that I miss them and I love them and I wish that I could provide something uh, for them right now uh, in terms of a relief. But yeah, that being said, if you want to watch some adventures, uh, you can binge watch the series and all that kind of stuff. And my goal is to not lose this land at the end of it and I'm hoping that I don't lose the stores, but that doesn't matter uh, compared to people's lives and the way that this may completely reshape the world. Uh, a lot of life is being lost, um, and my thoughts and prayers go out to those people. 
and thanks for letting me just express myself. Please abide by social distancing rules, listen to medical professionals during this whole thing, and let us hope that it blows over sooner than later. Um, but do your part in helping if you can, and just love someone today, be kind, do something good, and just be smart and safe out there. And thanks for watching, and whatever you do in life, try to enjoy it, <laughs> stay safe, peace.